What's up guys? So something that I do all the time before I go into the gym is I whip out my packet of gum and I put two pieces of gum. I usually chew Trident. Now quick tip if you're going to chew gum is you want a gum that has Exidol inside of it. Now I haven't found many brands so you, my camera's not going to zoom in. Um, some brands very rarely have Exidol as a first ingredient. And that's very good for the pH of your mouth. So if you drink coffee, um, after you eat, you want to chew Exidol. And it supposedly helps um, prevent like your teeth from eroding. Stuff like that. Okay, but I chew gum. And I swear to God, man, like I need to chew gum every day. I believe that it, it makes me sharper. It almost lifts my mood, okay? And it does this by increasing the blood flow to the brain. Now you can look that up yourself. But um, gum is super important. But another really cool thing about gum that I've noticed is your mouth posture. And many of you may think, what the hell is this? Okay, so if you look at your mouth and um, you ever hear of a mouth breather? So there's people that... <gasps> now, if you breathe like that for a long time, you start to get this like droopy look to your eyes. Um, your jaw probably suffers. And if you have that, it can... It can cause you to look, you know, tired and not look your best. And so it can also, it's not good for you to breathe through your mouth, okay? Maybe if you're doing the Wim Hof or do, during a heavy workout, but not all the time. So you'll notice that the way that your mouth posture is supposed to be is your teeth, your teeth are supposed to be rested on top of one another, another like this, all right? With your tongue pushing on the roof of the mouth. So what are you doing when you're just sitting there watching the video breathing? You got a massive overbite. When I was a kid, I had a big overbite and had to wear that stupid brace. Um, I still do, but I've noticed as I chew more gum, these muscles of your jaw, people love these muscles. They say, you know, you got a great jawline and it makes you look good. You can develop these. I think they're called your, um, someone, common, but your mass, mass, master muscle, something like that. Um, I know Zen Fit Philosophy has that down. So you can develop these things. You can also develop up here. So, you know, one of those things that girls do in Instagram photos, they always do this. They take the, the duck face. Well, they're doing that because it makes their jaw look a little sharper, okay? But also, when you develop, you want to have this developed. Um, and I've been chewing gum, and I've noticed that my resting posture, you can actually improve your jawline, guys. You can actually improve your damn face. And I'll link you to some Mike Mew videos, and you can begin to try these things out. There's this thing called tongue chewing, where you take your gum, and you go into a ball like this. And then instead of just munching on it, you're going to put it in the right in the middle, and push it with your tongue up against the roof of your mouth, like this. All right, and you just move it forward. And that works out these muscles up here. Um, I've noticed that as I've been chewing seeds, chewing more gum, my resting mouth posture is my tongue holding up this, because if your mouth breathing, you're like this. And there's no support for your this upper jaw. Okay, so all this begins to sag. Now, over time, you see that in the mirror. But as you're resting, the tongue is placed firm, not, you know, gently on top of the roof of the mouth, supporting, and then the teeth are stacked on top of one another. With gum, this is all going to get tight. I use two pieces because the heart of the gum, you know, one piece doesn't really do anything. It also, more blood flow to the brain. Um, I'm feeling better in the gym. But chewing sunflower seeds has really showed me a, a really quick improvement I've noticed. This may be complete placebo, guys. So, you know, if your jaw doesn't change, you don't become a model overnight. I don't want to hear it. But I take sunflower seeds, and not one at a time, but I put a handful in my mouth, and I put them all over here. So I got like 25, 30 seeds in my mouth at a time. And then I move one over to here, I crack it, and then I'm do almost doing the same duck face movement like this. And then I spit, and then I, I just go through a whole, you know, I go through a bunch of seeds like that when I'm taking a walk. And it's very enjoyable too. And I just, I can't, I don't know what it is, but something about 
chewing, something about getting that blood flow to the brain will literally increase your state. It almost makes me feel um, like, like an alpha wave, like a calmness, uh, really just dialed in. I can pay attention to the audiobooks that I'm listening to. So give it a shot. Again, check out the, the Mike Mew video because he's the only guy talking about this kind of stuff that I know of and it works. But also gum and seeds, really beneficial. So give it a shot, man. See you guys soon. Peace.